Well, hi there, pluckers. I'll have a soul finger again with you. Thanks indeed for joining me for a bit of a help lesson from one of my viewers. Uh, I had a request for some help well, with a song called Old Time's Sake by uh, an artist called Charlie Wersham. Okay. Um, been asked if I could explain what the, the uh, guitaring is actually, what the guitarist is actually playing. Okay. So um, I will put a link in the description box which takes you to a video of this particular song. It's the actual playing starts about 1 minute 50 into the song, okay? Just so you know that. Um, during the song there's a, this uh, little riff that he plays more or less all the way through the song. It's quite catchy um, and I think this is the main bit that's required. So it's something like this, um, okay? <laughs> That's roughly it. I mean, you'll, if you listen to the original, you'll see it play a lot better. But uh, that's the, uh, the gist of it, I think. Okay. So what I'm doing now, I'm in standard tuning below. There's no funny tunings going on here. Uh, standard tuning, and um, I'm doing it finger picking. Uh, well, I feel fingerish. Finger using my fingers. I wouldn't say it's finger picking. No. <laughs> finger with my fingers. Um, I think that's the way it sounds better that way. You can play it with a pick, but it's a bit. Uh, fierce with a pick. Okay, um, so what I'm doing here, I'm basically hitting my thumb is consistently hitting this during the riff six string open. Okay, and it starts off with a slide from about uh, on the fourth string from uh, the seventh fret to the ninth fret. And what you've got is a shape like this to start with. It's a ninth fret on the fourth string and the third string, G string, and the first finger is playing the seventh fret of the second string, the B string. Okay. And what you do is you slide up this seven to nine on the fourth string, hit the ninth on the third string, the seventh on the second back to the ninth fret on the third. Okay, what I'm doing, I'm using my just one finger for doing that bit, and my first finger here. Okay. My thumbs, and when you slide, you hit the sixth string at the same time. All right? Okay. Then what you do is you lower the fourth string to this, uh, to the, um, Eighth fret, okay, and you hit the sixth string and the fourth string together, and then the third string. I'd still stay in the third string, staying there on the ninth fret, okay. So, so far, you've got this, okay. Then you lower the fourth string to the using this finger, then comes back into play and moves up to the 7th fret of the 4th string, which you pluck together with the bottom E string again, and then play that ninth fret of the 3rd again, and then lower that 1st finger down to the 6th fret of the 4th string, again it's hit together with the bass uh, bottom E string, and then the 3rd string on the ninth fret again. Okay, so what you've got there is this. Okay, and it just repeats that. Okay. Right. Okay. 
does that about four times or so and then it goes into a chordy bit and it's basically a lazy, he's playing a lazy A just barring the second fret fourth string, third string and second string doing a strum, strumming now right, so he's strumming I'm using my nail but so to an E chord So it's because uh, um, here it goes. Uh, this is the bit that goes. That's what that sequence is. Is A A E C sharp minor, and what he's doing there is playing the fourth fret of the A string, the 5th string, the 6th fret of the 4th uh, string and the 6th fret of the 3rd string and is leaving the rest of the 2nd string and the top E string open. Okay, It's a sort of form of C sharp minor. Okay. So A And an F sharp seventh, F sharp bar chord, the way I play it anyway, F sharp bar chord, pinky off, and then a B seventh. And then he goes back to playing this riff, okay? So it's just Okay, and that's basically the gist of the song. So uh, just to repeat, so that's the riff. Does that about four times and then you go into the chorus which is A to E, E, C sharp minor, F sharp seven, B seventh, riff, twice. That's it, that's about all I can tell you about it. Hopefully that will help you play that song. Thanks very much, see you in the next video. Bye for now.